Okay, and then we continue with the contractions. Yeah, so to be contractions. So in Bahasa Indonesia, it's called the uh, singkatan. Yeah, so we contract or we shorten the to be. Yeah, so it is used when, especially when we speak. Yeah, okay, so when people speak, they often push two words together. Uh, it's called a contraction. Two words that are pushed together. Yeah. Okay. So contraction of a subject pronoun plus B are used in both uh, speaking and writing. Yeah. Gitu. So for example, I am a student. Yeah. So the, we can write it down. I'm a student. And she is a student. Yeah. She is a student. Yeah. He is a student. He is a student. It is a city. It's a city. You are a student. You're a student. You are students. You're students. We are students. We're students. They are students. They're students. So it's called a contraction. And contraction is also used in grammar okay so let's have an exercise about this uh, grammatically and in writing yeah okay so uh, complete the sentences use contractions <coughs> pronoun plus b yeah i'll make it large yeah okay here we go okay so Sarah is a student. She is in my class. Jim is a student. Yeah. Write down. Jim is is a male. He is in my class. Yeah. Okay. He is in my class. And I have one brother. Brother is a male yeah and he is he uh, I think I made mistake I should change this there we go yes he's 20 years old I have two sisters and then they they are students apostrophe yeah they apostrophe R E I have a dictionary uh, dictionary it's it's on my desk I like my classmates classmates the they are friendly. I have three books. They are they are on my desk. My brother is twenty six years old. He is <coughs> it's married. My sister is twenty one years old. She is she's She's single. Yeah. Married and single are adjectives. Yoko and Ali are students. They are they are in my class. I like my books. It's interesting. It's it's interesting. Yeah? Okay. Okay, so I hope that you guys understand about this. Okay, and we have uh, number until number sixteen. Yeah, until number sixteen. I like grammar, so I should write uh, names here. 
Palette Grammar, it's easy. It's easy. Kid and Dai live in an apartment. We are. Yeah. We are. We are. Well, it's, we live in an apartment. It's, it's I go to school. I am. I know you. You are in my English class. You are in my English class. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So uh, this is what we call the contractions. Yeah. Okay. So let's go to the next. The next character, and then uh, let's introduce the negative. Yeah. Let's introduce the negative. Negative with B. So, Tom is a teacher when the information is not correct. So, we will write down Tom is not a teacher or Tom isn't a teacher. Yeah, he is a student. Tom and Anne are teachers. If the information is not true, we will write Tom and Anne are not teachers or Tom and Anne aren't teachers. I am a teacher. When the information is true, when it is not true, we'll write down, I am not a teacher or I'm not a teacher. Yeah, so not makes a sentence negative. Yeah, not can be contracted with is and are. Yeah, so for example, is not, yeah, or isn't, yeah, and are not, uh, aren't, yeah. Okay, am and not are not contracted. I am not a teacher. Yeah, I you yeah, actually we can use contraction. Yeah, I'm not a teacher. Yeah. I am not a teacher. I'm not a teacher. Jadi yang C ini bisa di contract. Bisa di contract juga sebenarnya, yeah. Okay, so let's have an exercise. Yeah, so we will look at the picture. We'll study the picture. We'll study the picture and we will see uh, six people over here. Ms. Black, she is a bus driver. Jim is a painter or Jim is an artist. Mr. Rice is a policeman. Mike is a gardener and is a photographer. And Sue is a doctor. So those are the facts. Yeah, Those are the facts. Itu adalah faktanya pekerjaan-pekerjaan mereka ya yeah. so and we will write down the the facts ya yeah. ya yeah, jadi faktanya bagaimana itu yang harus kita tulis ya yeah. oke okay. so complete the sentences with the correct information ya yeah. horses ya yeah. horses aren't insects ya yeah. so horses they are, we can say, they are animals. Yeah. Okay. And then Asia, yes, that's true. Asia is a country. Yeah, is a country. Yeah, sorry, Asia is not a country. So Asia isn't. Yeah, isn't. Isn't a country. It's a continent. It is a continent. Yeah. Okay. Bees and ants are not animals or aren't, aren't animals. They are insects. They are insects. Arabic, Arabic, uh, Arabic is a, isn't a country, 
it is a language And I am, I am not, yeah, I am not, I am not a, photo, a professional photographer, yeah, okay, for example, I am a teacher, for example, yeah, I'm a teacher, yeah, okay, let's continue, and then, See, okay, yeah, okay, go get seventy. We need to look at the picture. Yeah, I hope it's still clear. Yeah, okay. So n n is not is. A, isn't a gardener she is a photographer okay. she is a photographer mike mike yeah that's true mike is a gardener mike is a gardener he isn't an artist he is a he isn't an artist. Yeah, Mike isn't an artist. Mike isn't an artist. And then Jim. Jim, Jim, Jim. Jim is not a bus driver. Jim isn't a bus driver. He is a painter. He is a painter. Or an artist yeah sue sue is a photographer oh no sue is not a photographer sue is a photographer she is a she is a doctor she is a doctor mr rice Mr. Rice, yes, that's true. Mr. Rice is a police officer. He is a, a doctor, for example. Yeah. And then Ms. Black. Ms. Black isn't isn't a photographer. Yeah, this black is a photographer. Uh, she is a bus driver. She is a bus driver. Okay, here you go. That's the answer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we practice using to be, not, present, and also nouns. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so I hope that you can understand this section, so we can continue to the next section, and uh, let's introduce the adjective. Yeah, so there are three kinds, uh, noun, adjective, and preposition, and this is the second one, this is the adjective. So, before this, you have studied noun, kata benda, yeah, setelah kata benda, kita diperkenalkan dengan kata sifat, setelah itu nanti preposition, yeah. So, adjectives, for example, around intelligent, hungry, young, or happy. Yeah, so they are adjectives. Yeah, adjective ini adalah uh, giving an additional information, giving a character to a noun. Jadi, adjective memberikan keterangan tambahan atau memberikan suatu sifat pada kata benda. Yeah, for example, round gives the additional information to a ball. Yeah, jadi ball itu bola diberi keterangan tambahan yaitu bentuknya bulat ya. And then intelligent is giving an information to Mary. Mary is intelligent ya. Yeah. Giving a, a one character of Mary is intelligent. Yes. Yeah. So 
the function of objective is to give additional information to give the character memberikan sifat dari suatu benda ya okay so for example a ball is round balls are round automatically ya because it is a plural Mary is intelligent Mary and Tom are intelligent ya I am hungry she is young and they are happy ya so objectives the function of adjective is giving an additional information to nouns ya nah adjectives often follow a form of b ya an adjective describes or give information about a noun or pronoun that comes at the beginning of the sentence ya so this is the function of adjective ya oke nah ini this is the function of adjective ya Oke, okay, here we go. Oke, okay. ya, oke, okay, enough ya. Jadi adjektif berada pada posisi setelah kata benda. Ya, sorry, setelah verb. Ya, setelah verb dan adjektif memberikan informasi tambahan tentang noun atau pronoun. Ya, pronoun adalah kata ganti orang. Ya. Gitu. Oke, okay, so let's continue and have an exercise about this complete the drawings make the faces happy sad and angry show your drawing to student B yeah she is angry she is sad they are happy and something like that yeah okay so yeah for example like happy sad yeah. okay I'm not very good at this yeah Oke, okay, so let's just pass this one. And we have uh, several adjectives in the box, such as beautiful, clean, cold, dangerous, and easy. So be careful, clean here is clean is adjective, ya. Yeah? Oke, okay, but clean with the same spelling can also mean membersihkan. Jadi tergantung juga konteksnya ya. Jadi jenis kata bisa berbeda sesuai dengan konteks ya. Yeah. Oke, okay, so I'll do a demonstration for you. I'm not happy, I'm not sad, I'm happy. Ice isn't hot. Uh, but it is cold. Ya, yeah. so please pay attention. Untuk adjektif kita nggak pakai tidak ada bentuk tunggal atau jamak. Itu tidak ada. Ya, jadi ekspansif ya ekspansif jadi nggak ada ekspansif atau fast open ya open jadi nggak ada opens ya itu itu jadi adjective has no singular or plural form ya nggak punya bentuk tunggal atau jamak ya itu satu bentuknya ya Mr. Thomas is not rich he is ya yeah. my hair isn't long it's short ya. my clothes aren't dirty they are are clean ya. so and the other characteristic of, of adjective is they have opposites ya subjectives these have opposites Or in bahasa Indonesia, all this lawan kata, ya, yeah? oke. Okay. Uh, flowers aren't ugly, they are beautiful. They are beautiful. Cars aren't cheap, they are expensive. And then airplanes aren't slow, they are fast. Are fast, ya. Yeah. Grammar isn't difficult. It is easy. My sister isn't short. The opposite of short is she is tall. My grandparents aren't young. They are old. The dormitory isn't quiet. Dormitory means. Uh, Asrama ya, a place for 
students uh, living for students it is noisy yeah so it's the opposites right? and we have a few more questions the door isn't closed the answer is it is open yeah open 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 is objective guns aren't safe they are dangerous sorry and lemons aren't sweet they are sour uh, sour yeah okay so this is the opposite yeah uh, lawan kata yeah okay so I think it's pretty simple but if you have a questions you can stop and ask me yeah, put your questions on comment or give me a message uh, and let's continue to the next uh, lemon sugar water and they become lemonade yeah. okay and then use adjective to describe things yeah okay rounds okay so we can skip exercise 15 and uh, make sentences by using is or are an adjective from the following list yeah okay let's increase the size of this 85 yeah okay here you go yeah make sentences so fire is hot ice and snow yeah somebody guess ice and snow what do you think ice and snow are cold a box. What do you what do you what do you think? What is the character of a box? A box is square. Yeah. So remember, guys, that for the adjective, we do not use plural or singular. Yeah, just adjective. Adjective is only one. Jadi tidak ada bentuk tunggal jama itu tidak ada apa-apa. And balls are oranges. Are brown. Sugar, sugar is sweet. Uh, yeah, so this is the answer. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is the answer. And then an elephant. Elephant is large or big, but a mouse is small or little a rainforest a rainforest uh, should be in the wrong that position how can I okay. how can I do this Okay, a rainforest is wet, yeah, wet, basah, but a desert, desert is dry or green, a lemon is sour, a joke is funny, Good health is important. Flowers, flowers are beautiful. Anybody like flowers? A coin is what is this? A coin is small, round, and what? Coin is small, round, and cheap, perhaps. Yeah. Okay, there you go. That's the combination of to be and adjectives. Yeah. And then the combination is going to be a little bit more complex by using, by deciding whether the information is true or not. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So in exercise 17. We have a 
a ball isn't square because ball and square is not true yeah balls round yes that's true so balls are round yeah Okay, here we go. And we have a, uh, a mouse. What do you think, guys? A mouse? Is it mouse is a pig? What? Uh, usually, mouse is a pig. So, mouse is a pig. Lemons? Do you think? Are lemons yellow? Yes. Lemons are yellow. Right bananas, are they yellow too? I think so. Right bananas are yellow. Uh, this, is, this one is wrong. It should be... What is this? Can I be a bit? Yeah. Lemons are yellow. A lemon is sweet, do you think? Most of lemons are sweet? I don't think so. Uh, lemons are a uh, lemon. Uh, sorry, not orange, but is it sweet? It is sour. Yeah, it is sour. A diamond. Do you think diamond? Diamond. A diamond is not cheap, guys. Diamonds are expensive. Yeah. So pay attention. This is uh, R. Yeah. Uh, what do you think? Uh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Okay. Yeah, diamonds are expensive. And since the diamonds. Yeah, okay. There we go. Apples. Uh, do you think apples are expensive? I don't think so. Apples are expensive. The earth is flat. I don't think so. The earth is flat. It's round. Yeah. My pen. Uh, my pen is heavy or not? My pen is heavy. It is light. It is light. And then we have uh, this room. This room. This room is not dark. Dark, so it is, it is light. English grammar, what do you think? Is hard or easy? I think it's not really hard for me. So I write down English grammar is hard, but it is easy. Yeah, this exercise is it difficult? I don't think so. The exercise is not difficult. It's easy, but I think it's a subjective. Yeah, so if you if you answer, it's it's based on yourself. Yeah, my classmates, my classmates, where are my classmates? Nobody's here, but my classmates and the next door are friendly. My classmates are friendly. So this book is actually for students. Yeah. Okay, so this is the answer. And the right grammar for all of the questions in this book. And let's go to the next. Oh, there are still some other questions. Turtle, what do you think? Turtle, guys? Turtle, I think it's slow, yeah? Airplanes? Airplanes are slow. Oh, no, no, airplanes are not slow. Airplanes are not slow. They are, they are fast, fast guys. The floor in this classroom, floor in this classroom, yeah, floor in the classroom is clean. It is not dirty, so it isn't dirty. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah, the weather, is it cold? Weather uh, is not cold today. Is it cold? The sun it is bright. Yeah, it's bright. The sun, the 
is bright here in Indonesia, Surabaya right now. Ice cream and candy. Ice cream and candy. Are they sour? No. Ice cream and candy. Uh, candy aren't sour, but they are sweets. My shoes. My shoes. My shoes. I think shoes. My shoes. Yeah, two shoes. Yeah, surely not only one. Two. Two shoes. Yeah. Hair. Hair. Shoes. My shoes. My shoes, and they are comfortable. Yeah. My desk. My desk. Uh, not really comfortable. Is it the office? Campus, my desk, is it comfortable right now? Flowers? No, flowers are beautiful. Flowers aren't ugly. They are beautiful. Traffic at rush hour. Traffic at rush hour is noisy. It is not quiet. Yeah, it is quiet. Yeah. Okay, guys, so that's the demonstration of how to answer the how to answer this exercise to be positive or to be negative positive we use positive when the statement is true we use negative when the statement is not true yeah okay i hope that you can understand and got the benefits of learning with me yeah okay and then, uh, are they describing me? Yeah, are they describing me? Hungry? Uh, I'm not hungry. Are you hungry? Thirsty. Am I thirsty? Am I thirsty? Uh, thirsty, thirsty. Yeah. Got some water. Thirsty. Uh, yes, I'm thirsty. Okay. And then sleepy. Am I sleepy? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I'm sleepy a little bit. Yeah. Okay, I'll put this over there. Yeah. Careful. And then, uh, am I tired? A uh, little bit tired. Am I old? Uh, <laughs> I don't want to think that I'm old. Yeah? Okay. Am I young? Yes, I want to think that I'm young. How about you? How old are you? But no matter how old you are, but we are still young. Yeah, and we are energetic. Yeah, that's our spirit. And then, uh, am I happy? Yes, I'm happy. Are you? Yeah, we are happy. Am I homesick? Oh no. So I live with my mom. I live with my family. So I'm not homesick. Yeah? Okay. Am I married? Yes, I am. I have a partner. I have a wife. Am I single? Of course not. I'm not single. Am I angry? No, I'm not angry. Am I nervous? No, I'm not nervous. Am I friendly? Yes, I'm friendly. Am I lazy? No, I'm not lazy. I wouldn't make this video if I were lazy. Am I hardworking? Yeah, yes, I'm hardworking. Am I famous? No, I'm not, but I believe I will be. Yeah. Am I sick? Oh, thank God, I'm healthy now. Am I healthy? Yes, I am. Am I friendly? Yes, I am. Am I shy? No, I'm not. Yeah, you know, I used to be, but for now, I'm not. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So again, describing me. Yeah. So it's uh, describe me, describe me. So uh, describing. So it's an adjective. Yeah. Yeah, so the function objective, yeah. 
function of an objective is to describe or give additional information to the town. Yeah, this information to the town. Okay, then objective. Yeah, can you say it? J. Yeah, as no plural form. Yeah, jadi dia tak punya plural form. Yeah, yeah. and objective. Uh, most of most of objectives have opposites. Yeah, they have opposites. Mereka punya lawan kata. Yeah. 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 Okay. So this is my explanation about objective. Yeah. Okay. And I hope that you understand and get the benefit of uh, watching and listening this video. And let's continue to another objective do any of this word describe the city describe the city is a description yeah uh, describe the city yeah so the city city of surabaya yeah city of surabaya the place i'm living right now is surabaya big yes it is surabaya is big yeah is surabaya small no, it isn't. Surabaya is not a small city. Is Surabaya an old city? Yes, Surabaya is an old city. A very old city. Is Surabaya modern? I think so. Surabaya is modern city. Is Surabaya clean? Yes, right now Surabaya is clean. Is Surabaya city dirty? No, it is not right now. Are people of Surabaya friendly? Yes, most of them are friendly, but we still have to be careful when we are on the street. Are people of Surabaya unfriendly? I don't think so. No, they are not. Is Surabaya safe? Uh, you can say that again, that Surabaya is safe, but we still need to be careful. Is Surabaya dangerous? Uh, it's actually pretty safe right now, but we still have to be dangerous. We still have to be careful. Yeah? Okay, yeah, so this is describing the city, how uh, adjectives, adjectives des describe the city of Surabaya, yeah, yeah. And then for exercise 20, I think we are supposed to make a sentences, yeah. So for example, uh, for example, a ball is round, yeah, ball and round, yeah. We have to make sentence, yeah. Okay, ball is round, ball square. No, balls aren't square. And then we have uh, a box square. Yeah, box is not square. Yeah, a box. Yeah, where is an example of a box? Box, something. Yeah, I think you know a box. A box is not square. A box is... Oh, sorry. Square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. I made a mistake. Yeah, a box is square. A box is not round. Yeah. The earth, what do you think, guys? The earth is flat or round? Yeah. For number three. Yeah. The earth is not flat. I think the I believe that the earth is not flat. I believe that the earth is round. Yeah. And for number five, bananas. Bananas red? No, bananas are not red. Bananas yellow? Yes, bananas are yellow. Seven and eight. Diamonds, expensive or cheap? Yeah, yeah. Diamonds are expensive, guys. So, and uh, diamonds are not cheap. Yeah. Apples number nine, expensive? I don't think so. Apples are not really expensive. So apples are not expensive. Number ten, air and free. Yeah. So free means that we don't have to pay. Yeah, that's true. Air is free right now in 2020. Cars free? No. We don't. Have, we have to pay for having the car, so cars are not free. And then a pen heavy? Uh, no, pen is not heavy. 
Yeah, so pen we we are hold we hold the pen, so pens are not supposed to be heavy. So a pen is not heavy. Number thirteen, a pen is light. And then number fourteen, flowers ugly? No, flowers aren't ugly. Flowers are beautiful. A rose is beautiful. Number sixteen, a turtle is not fast. Number seventeen, a turtle is slow. Number eighteen, airplanes are not slow. Number nineteen, airplanes are fast. Number twenty, English grammar is not difficult according to me. Yeah, uh, but if you think it's difficult, so you make a positive verb. English grammar is easy for number twenty-one according to me. Yeah, so that's why I can share you about this. Yeah, and number twenty-two, the exercise is not hard. Yeah, okay. Number twenty-three, the weather is. Is it hot? No, not really. It is not hot today. The weather is cold. Yeah, it's cool actually, but not cold. Yeah, the weather is not cold. It's not hot. It's not cold, but it's cool. Yeah. Lemons are sweet. No, usually lemons are not sweet. Lemons are not sweet. Ice cream and candy are not sour. Traffic, traffic, traffic. Traffic is not noisy because it's a pandemic. Yeah. Okay, so some people are still locked down. City streets, city streets, uh, not are not quiet, but they are not noisy. Just in the middle, yeah, Jolie. But usually, city streets are not quiet. Yeah, education, yes, education is very important. Good food is very important. Good food and exercise are important. The students in this class, no students, no students. It's pandemic, so most of students study at home. Yeah, okay then. Yeah, but suppose there are students around here. The students in this class are very intelligent. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I have demonstrated and the oral exercise. Yeah. Of you by using is, isn't, are, or aren't and adjectives. Yeah. I hope that you understand. And we can come to the next. Yeah. So we need to say something which is hot. Something that is hot. What is something that is hot? Yeah. Okay. So anybody knows something that is hot? Oh, I think fire is hot. Yeah, so fire is hot. Yeah. Square. Yeah, a box is square. Sweet. Uh, what is sweet? Uh, oranges? Apples? Oh, sugar. Sugar is sweet. Yeah. Sour. Lemons are sour. Large. This building is large. Flat. Uh, my mobile phone is flat. Yeah, my mobile phone screen is flat. Little. Uh, what is little? Uh, what is little? Uh, something little. I think an N is little. Yeah. Yeah. And important. Uh, my laptop is important. Education is important. Yeah. Cold. What is cold? Uh, what is cold? Yeah. Ice. Ice is cold. Funny. A joke is funny. Beautiful. Uh, my mom is beautiful. <laughs> okay. My wife is beautiful. Yeah. My sister is beautiful. Yeah. Expensive. This laptop is expensive. Yeah. This mobile phone is expensive. Yeah. Cheap. Uh, what is cheap? This mineral water is cheap, yeah. Yeah, it's cheap. Free. Uh, air is free. Air is free. Delicious. Uh, food is delicious. Uh, ice cream is delicious. Uh, ice cream. Oh, let's say delicious. Uh, a Kentucky fried chicken is delicious, yeah. A 
Oke okay, ya. Hamburger is delicious. Ya. Yeah? Oke. Okay. Next. Ya. Yeah? Oke. Okay, so. In the next part. We are coming to. The and uh, location. Ya. Yeah? Location. Ya. Yeah? Oke. Okay, the and the location. So. Remember number one. We have to remember. There is number one. Yeah, I write down here. Noun plus noun. Number two, noun plus verb. Oh, I say to be plus adjective. Yeah. Number three, noun plus to be. Yeah. Plus preposition. Yeah. Position of place or one. Okay. Plus to be plus now. Yeah. Okay, so this is number three. Yeah. Okay, so number three noun plus to be plus preposition. Preposition of could be for place or time. A place is a location. Yeah. So for example, here at the library. Yeah, there, downstairs, upstairs, inside, outside, downtown. So those words are location. Yeah, those words are places. Yeah, okay. And then preposition is usually combined with noun. So I uh, will write that here. Preposition plus noun. Yeah, okay. Yeah, preposition plus noun or prepositional phrase. Yeah, I will write it here. It's a prepositional phrase. Yeah, so remember prepositional phrase or PP. Yeah, okay, so at the library. So at is a preposition, library is a noun. So the combination becomes uh, at the library, it becomes. Uh, Prepositional phrase, yeah, okay, okay. So at the library, on the bus, in this room, at work, or next to Maria. So you can follow me, yeah. You can, you can say after me, yeah, okay. And then we can combine with the uh, verb to be, yeah. For example, Maria is here. Bob was at the library. Maria is here, Maria is there, Maria is downstairs, Maria is upstairs, Maria is inside, Maria is outside, Maria is downtown, and blah, blah, blah. Yeah? Okay, so here is a location, and the library is a location. Yeah? Okay. Okay, that's right. Yeah? Preposition phrase. And some common prepositions can be above, at, behind, between, from, in, next to, on, and under. So those are the prepositions showing places. Ya, kata depan yang menunjukkan tempat. Ya, yeah, so preposition of place. Ya, yeah. okay. So remember preposition of place and time, and also prepositional phrase. Ya, yeah, so remember that. Ya. Yeah. Okay. And another meaning. Another meaning. On. Yeah, so the ball is on the box. Yeah, on. It's exactly on the box. Okay, I'll give you an example. Exactly. Where is the box? I'm going to use an example of a box. And let's say, not very good, a banana. Yeah, so a box, a banana, oh, let's see, banana, right, yeah, yeah, like this, yeah, so, sorry guys, it's not really, it's a little bit ugly, okay, yeah, a box and the banana is on the box, yeah, okay, and then it's in, I open this, oh my goodness, and then a banana, a banana, and the first, and so a banana is in the box, 
uh, stock it up here. It's in the box. It's in the box. Yeah. Pada dah is in the box. Yeah. Close it. It's in the box. Pada dah is in the box. And then uh, I put this out. Okay. Surprise! 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 Okay, I close this. And a banana, a box, a lunch box. A banana is next, next to, next to, next to the lunch box. And banana is uh, above. Above, yeah, above, above, above. This one is called above. Yeah, yeah. I can see, guys. Yeah, camera. Above, yeah. It's above. But this one is on. Banana is on the box. Banana is above this box. Yeah. And banana is under the box. Banana is behind the box. Yeah. Okay. I hope that you understand. Okay, and on in next to above under behind are prepositions. Yeah, and after preposition can be followed by a noun. Okay, yeah. Okay, complete the sentences with preposition that describe the pictures. Use prepositions only one time. Okay, and we have the cat. The cat is on the desk the cat is above the desk so you know the difference here yeah, between on and above and the cat is under the desk and the cat is between between two desks and let's see the cat is next to next to the desk or beside beside the desk and then the cat is behind the desk yeah do you like cats okay yeah okay yeah, do you have any questions? If you have a question, you can write down on the comment below. Yeah, okay. Find the preposition and prepositional phrase in the following. Mine is in this apartment. Is in this, in my, in a preposition, in this apartment, prepositional phrase. So, we are studying prepositional phrase. We are studying this yeah, prepositional phrase. Yeah. Okay, Mr. Lee is an airport. Yeah. Okay, so prepositional phrase. At the airport is a prepositional phrase. And then from Egypt, prepositional phrase. Let's see. Okay, please guess this. Follow me answering these questions by guessing in this pocket prepositional phrase on first street. Hey, what's going on? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Uh, on first street. So maybe we can make it bigger by giving it to 100. Oh no, it's too big. That's not it. Uh, that's okay. Next to the bank, preposition of phrase. Another under my desktop. Preposition of phrase. Between. Oh no. Hey, what's going on? Oh no. Yeah, here we go. Let's have a look. On first between my desk. And then uh, on the third floor. On the third floor. 
positional brace above is a constant prepositional phrase ya so it's called let's let me call it yeah so those are called prepositional phrase ya yeah? so those are the examples of the prepositional phrase Okay, so I hope that you understand. And if you are still confused or have a question, please feel free to ask me or send me a message. Yeah, okay, or email. Okay, and then, so, okay, we can skip that. Summary. That was summary. Let's see. Right. Uh, but enough. Okay, how about 85? Yeah, okay, 85. Yeah, okay, so let's have, uh, let's have a summary, yeah? Summary, sentence. Subject be noun, subject be objective, subject be location. Yeah, so subject, yeah? So the, the beginning part of a set, the beginning part in the sentence is called a subject. Yeah. Okay, on almost all English sentences, sentences have subject and the verb. Yeah, yeah. So sentences, we have uh, sentences. Yeah, so sentences have subject, and sentences have a verb. Yeah. Okay, sentences have subject. Okay, so let's answer this one. Dogs are animals. Okay, dogs are animals. B is okay, dogs are plus animals. Animals are now okay check is a book check this plus that book prep that's just prep this position of place place or location yeah, yeah but I can use a uh, place yeah Stupid. No, how to deal with this? No, 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 no. Uh, oh, here we go. He is sick. Go. Gina is upstairs. Yes, yes. 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 Pockets are empty. Then yes, no questions with B. Yeah, yes, no questions with B. Yeah.
So we have a positive sentence, negative sentence, and questions. So let me write down sentences. Positive sentence. That's positive. We have negative sentence. Uh, we can say negative verb. Yeah. Yeah, of course, negative sentence, yeah, negative sentence, negative verb, yeah, verb, and then questions, questions, positive verb, question. Yes, no questions. Formation. Oh, that's the review. It's questions. Yeah. yeah, positive verb, negative verb. Yes, no questions. Or yes, no questions. Yes, no. Yes, no verb. Yes, no questions. Yes, no question for. Yeah, yes, no questions. Yes, no questions. No, yes, no questions for. And W gets questions for. Okay. okay. Well, you can also say that we have a positive sentence, negative sentence, yes, no question, and uh, information questions. W gets questions. So. Okay, and now we have uh, yes, no questions in this part, yeah? Okay, yeah, so these are the kinds of sentences. Okay, for yes, no questions, we have, uh, oh, okay, make questions and give short answer. Yeah, so we have the, we have an uh, answer and we, we are supposed to make questions, yeah? Okay, yeah. Uh, the answer is, I'm not noticing. Question is okay. Are you homesick? Yeah, question mark. The answer is I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Yeah. Okay. Let's stop. Okay. Is Bob homesick? Are the students in this class intelligent? Are the students in this class intelligent? Yes, they are intelligent. They 
is AR. And then we still have number seven. Oh, a few more questions. Uh, are the chairs in this room comfortable? Yes, they are. The answer is yes. Are you married? No, I'm not. Are Tom and the uh, are Tom and you roommates? Tom and die are roommates. Yes, we, we are. This butterfly and birds is a butterfly bird. No, it isn't. Yeah, okay, yeah. Like this. Okay, 